Steal for the fifth, 18,000 plus on the carryover. One fax led on by Jerome Rini, Sandy Beatty drives. Two Gigolo Bill owned by the home stock farm with Dave Hawk. Three Hills Honor Elliott owned and driven by Justin Hall. Four is Emma Heather, owned by Robert Lee and Mary Kay Harriot with Jack Daly aboard. Five, Miss Julia, owned by Roger Bartley and Roger Jr. with Ron Steck in the bike. Six, Gopher King Brown, owned by Eileen Brown with Jim Daly. Seven, CSI Dan the Man, owned by the CSI Farm with Frank Todd Jr. Eight is Carry the Lady, owned by Ken Appleman with Bill Long Jr. Number nine, Dizzy Die, owned by Francis and Milton Schloss with Dave Rankin. Ten, Carry the Ribs, owned by Tom Gregory. And Ted Gregory, Tim Hackett will be in the sulky. Trotters for the fifth, welcoming the Mechanical Contractors Association. Five minutes till post time. Theo for the fifth, moving through the clubhouse turn. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off and trotting. The two, Gigolo Bill is off stride. The three, Hills Honor Iliad is off stride. The eight, Carry the Lady never got near the gate. They're down the back stretch. Seven, kick out for command and go for King Brown gets the call. Emma Heather moves in to be second. Followed by CSI, Dan the man who tucks in there nicely third. Fax line is fourth to the turn. Next in line comes Dizzy Die to fifth. From out of the second tier, carry the ribs to sixth. As they trot by the opening quarter in 29 and three. They're off that top turn and trotting past the stands. Miss Julia moves in to be seventh. After that, it's carry the lady in eighth. Back down trotting hills. Honor Iliad caught the field ninth. Far back to the trailer after that costly early break. Gigolo Bill around the clubhouse turn to the half mile pole. Gopher King Brown continues to lead the way. Here comes Fax Line trotting up on the outside. Pocket sitter is Emma Heather. CSI Dan the Man got caught along the pylons in fourth. Trotting up on the outside. Carry the ribs. He's trotting in a spare time as they hit the half in 101 and 2. They're down the back stretch. Dizzy Die is sixth. In between horses, Miss Julia to seventh. Carry the Lady is eighth on the outside. Hills Honor Iliad is ninth. Far back trailer, Jiggle Bill. They're into three quarters, bouncing right along. Gopher King Brown, he's trying to make every pull the winning one. Fax line is up on the outside toward the rail. Long shot, Emma Heather, racing by three quarters in 131 and three. Trotters to the head of the stretch. Leaders are heads apart. Gopher King Brown, Fax line on the outside. Emma Heather, rolling up on the far outside, carry the ribs, another 70 to one bomb, racing through the stretch, fax line, Emma Heather closing up on the pylons, Emma Heather, fax line, go for King Brown and carry the ribs, here comes carry the ribs. In his spare time, carry the ribs, the unofficial winner. Six, go for King Brown was second. Number one, fax line third, seven, CSI, Dan the Man fourth. Result of the fifth race is now official. Windows open on the sixth. No changes, exact the trifecta wagering field of 10. No changes in tonight's sixth race. Got it all in a twin try. 10 6 exacta. 9 57 even. 10 6 all, the $1 payoff. 8 20. Folks, that's not the carryover, that's the pool. 8 20 70. There's over 22,000 in the pool. Still hittable tonight. Here comes Carry the Rips. Three year old Bay Gelling by Carry the Message out of Daylight Hanover. Owned by Tom and Ted Gregory of Loveland and Montgomery. Ran and trained by Tim Hackett. 
Carving them out here in 202 to establish a lifetime best. 10, carry the ribs, the winner. Post time in 14 minutes at 9.14. Folks, that is not the carryover because it's not a carryover until somebody misses it in the seventh race. That's the pool going into race seven.